I'm Truett from eBMX and today I'm going to be teaching you how to install a YSS spring onto your YSS shock. Let's do it. So first things first, we need to get the shock out of the bike. Start by removing the top linkage bolt, then the swing arm linkage bolt, then the top shock eye bolt. Now the easiest way to remove the shock is to make it do a backflip. Straight over the back like that, it comes out nice and easy. Right, now undo the grub screw of the spring collar and finish removing the linkage from the shock itself. Now then, you're going to need to grab this little handy dandy bag that comes with your YS shock and in there, there will be this little rod. Hopefully you didn't throw it out. Now before backing off the collar, please make sure the threads are perfectly clean, no muck or grime so you don't destroy the threads on your shock body. Now that you've undone your grub screws, you can use that rod to turn the collar and release the preload off the spring. Right, now we're going to remove the spring keeper, push down the bump stop and the spring keeper will slide straight out. Now you can slide your spring straight off and there will be these spring washers that will need to be reinstalled. So as you can see here, we've now put our spring washers top and bottom, put our spring on, everything in reverse, put our spring keeper back in, flip the shock back up the other way, and you can tighten your collar back down. And obviously you can tighten this as much as you want, depending on how much preload you would like. Once you're happy, tighten up your grub screws and we can reinstall it in the bike. So, attaching that bottom linkage once again, make sure you get it the right way around. This time we're doing a front flip into the bike, reinstall our top bolt, reinstall our swing arm linkage bolt, reinstall our triangle linkage bolt, and you're done. So there you go, nice and simple. That's how you change the spring over on the YSS shock. Thanks for watching, we'll see you in the next one.